everyone, Dr. Chris here, and today is the first video in the series of videos that I'm going to be making while I am a free agent in GIS and in geoscience. Today's video is going to be on a particular software package that is very dear to my heart, something that I'm going to continuously use into the future and something I think that is super duper powerful. And I'm going to be talking about it right about now. Here we go. All right, here I am back in my home office. That is because I am now a free agent in both geoscience and GIS and video production. Both. And in this video, I'm going to be talking about a software package that I know you love and that I love and that a lot of people hate. But it seems to me that there's only two solutions in the GIS world, and this is one of them. This is the paid one of them, and that is ArcGIS Pro. Not the commercial version. The commercial version, I think, is eight to $10,000. I can't remember the exact number. I didn't sign the checks. I just suggested the purchases. So it's not the commercial version. And while I have installed it on my system right now, and I have looked at what's offered, and it seems to be a lot of stuff. I'm not 100% sure that it is going to be everything in the Esri suite of software. Hopefully it is, because I'm looking forward to using it. So without further ado, here we go. Again, I'm going to look at ArcGIS Pro for personal use. Before I go any further, I will have to mention this. No, Esri is not paying me for this. I am not a shill. I'm a bit of a fanboy. If Esri does want to pay me, go right ahead. Now, of course, why am I using ArcGIS for personal use? Well, that is because I was in industry and guess what? With the COVIDs and oil being given away, currently, I find myself with no job. This is a bit of a good thing and a bit of a bad thing. The good thing is I get to make more videos. The bad thing is eh, money flow is a little short. That's okay. I'm going to make more videos because I love making videos for you. Again, why did I choose ArcGIS Pro for personal use? I have to say, man, the price was absolutely right. Man, it is cheap. Comparatively cheap again. In Canadian pesos, it was like 150 bucks. It could have been open source, like the other software package, which I am going to talk about briefly. But for the price and how much you get with it, man, I, I'm not sure if anything can compete with ArcGIS Pro for personal use. At the very least, you get Pro and Online, which is pretty amazing because I already know how versatile it is to go from Pro to Online and back again. Now, in a civilian capacity, we'll see what I can do with it. The advertisement online shows that it comes with Collector, Survey123, Quick Capture, what else we got? Dashboard Insights. Now, I don't know how to use Insights. I'm sure it's like Dashboard, because Dashboard's fun. Operation Dashboards. The integration alone with all these apps makes the price tag pretty darn good, especially when it comes with free training. Now, I did see that some of the training wasn't free, like some of the massive app integrations were, were courses that cost ooh, upwards to a thousand, two thousand dollars. But learning the basics is, is part of the price. Man, count me in. Which brings me to the other GIS solution, which I'm sure that some of you enjoy out there. And that would be QGIS. Now, I do have it installed on this machine. However, I have to say, I know nothing about it really. I think I've used it about three times. Can it go online easily? Can it do analytics easily? Can it do mobile apps easily? I suppose I should take the word easily out of there. Because if it's open source, it may not be easy, but it certainly would be a lot cheaper, especially if we're talking about in an industry setting. I will tackle this in future videos, and maybe I'll call them like ArcGIS Pro User Tries QGIS. We'll see how it goes. I'll leave it right there saying that I'm going to be looking at ArcGIS Pro for personal use. I'm going to put out videos showing how to use some of the tools. Should be a lot of fun. Stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, add me to your LinkedIn, or even better, share my videos through your networks. Till next time, I'm Dr. Chris. Keep rocking.